usually keep a guitar tuned to open E and open A, mm. and then um, then a standard tuned guitar. And uh, I was planning on this one being the open A one, but then it just kind of changed my plans. What do you hear in it? You know, I, I like compared I, to a standard. I tone. honestly thought it was going to be a lot more. Um, a lot weirder sounding. Yeah, I thought it was gonna be a lot more like kind of uh, uh, like a, a real novelty kind of sound. Right. But it's become, I mean, it's not that way, at all. It's like a guitar that I can use for most of what I want. It's just really, it's I like really round, thick kind of like. Um, I don't like things to be too thin, but when I want it to be punchy, I I, I love the way this back pickup, the the bridge pickup sounds. It's like yeah. punchy as hell. But the the you know the neck pickup is like really round and and it, it reacts really well to my whole to my whole rig a lot. Um, it reacts really well to a to a gain pedal. I mean it reacts to a lot of things really nicely. Totally. Um, so yeah, I think you know I, like I said, man, I thought it was going to be a lot a lot more like you know like a. Once a show, yeah, kind of like, I think we were in the check this sound world. out, you know, and we people just, being like, whoa, what's that sound? Yeah, but it's more like... We just started making it because yeah. it was like a steel Telecaster, right. and then we plugged it in, and it was like, man, yeah. like, there's something going on here. Yeah. I mean, you know, Take a little time with me. Yeah, I want. 
want you to come on, come on, wherever you are, take a little time with me. Come on, come on, wherever you are, take a little time. just like everybody's flipping out about it you know everybody that sees it is like what the fuck is that you know and everybody's like god it's so heavy you know but i've been carrying around that national for a long time and it's like right it's not any more it's not any heavier than that thing you no. know so i mean no it's 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 a great guitar it sounds so big and thick i expected it to sound thinner too that's the thing is for me i was like a little concerned that it would sound like a little thinner than I wanted it to sound, but it doesn't, you know, that, that, and that back pickup is so, the, the bridge pickup is so nasty, you know, yeah. so. You know, if I want to tell you, that's, yeah. that, it's right there. And I think it's got a little bit of raspiness in yeah. it too, so yeah. you got a bite, but it's not harsh. Exactly. Yeah, and I think this, you know, the hollow body helps that. Yeah, I think so too, you know, I mean. <laughs> It's either it's either front or back. Oh, same. Yeah, yeah. on that Collings over there. Same yeah, thing. yeah, It's yeah. just like, what's it for? No, that's that's all I that's all I do. You know, it's, it's it, the two combined for some reason. I've never had a guitar where I really like that sound. Yeah. You know, but yeah, it's it's great. You know, I was it's saves me some space. I was taking my I have this Gibson ES125 from the 50s that I love. That's a cool big, guitar. Big, you know, how so yeah. it's like full full body guitar and. That was my main guitar for the trio gig, yeah. um, but uh, but man, um, this is kind of taking that over, you know. And tonight's a five-piece band. Nice. And Drew Howard, the guy that was playing, somebody there was some video of him playing one of your like oh, one of his yeah. students has one. Yes. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. He's playing pedal steel. Tonight. Oh, cool. He's a great pedal steel player. He plays just about everything in the world. Yeah, yeah, it's it's this five piece band has been really fun. Um, it's, you know, full full drum kit. You know, Hammond B three, Wurlitzer. Um, They're on the whole tour tour with you. No, I'm doing the tour is like a tr is the tree is a trio. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's me and the keyboard player and percussionist. But this five piece band is like Michigan dates and Midwest dates. You know, closer stuff that I don't. It's just too much overhead. To, yeah. You know, travel with a five piece band right now. So buy it. <laughs> Spend your money. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Yeah, man. 